Hello friends, welcome to LMS Solution Research Support. In this video, we are going to discuss about an important part in our research paper that is the results and discussions part. We have discussed about how to write introduction, how to make literature survey and how to make a theoretical content in literature survey. And also we have seen many conversion process, how to generate content like that we have discussed so far. So writing results and in this uh, results and discussions chapter, so you have only pictures and tables. So you will be doing, for example, you can see here, so for example, say it is a chapter four results and discussions, you will be having a comparison uh, simulation results or you may be having any tabler column by comparing different algorithms, different methods for the different parameters. So you have to make theoretical content for this particular chapter that is results and discussions. So we have already discussed how to convert a table and a table to uh, theoretical content in chat GPT. So here uh, I am going to give an important prompt to get a precise output using uh, a particular prompt. So that is uh, in favor of your uh, work you have done so far. So first we will discuss about how to convert this image into theoretical content. So first I, what I am going to do is I am going to open chat GPT. So and another important site is that so you can go for OCR that is uh, OCR.best. So here click, in, click on that. So here what you have to do is what you can do is you can drag and drop files here so that files can be converted into text that is text so that text can be used for uh, conversion of that image into paragraph so how we can use that we can go on step by step process first what i am going to do is i am going to copy this image so just you can copy the image Here what I have did is I have copied the two image into two, two uh, separate J, uh, PNG files that is power you can see the picture here power and and duty cycle so here you can see this is duty cycle so this is power versus time graph. So what I am going to do is, well, I am going to open that OCR.best, I am going to draw, drag and drop that file. So first what I am going to do is, I am going to select that first image power. So after that you can click here and click convert. So it will take several seconds. Here you can see uh, the, the text available in this particular uh, image is generated. So you can copy the same and open your chat GPT. So and copy that. So in this we are going to give a prompt. So what is the prompt is explain the above result image details generated from the OCR. So what you have to do is you just uh, go to chat GPT and copy and paste this. For example, if you want about 50 words, if you want about 100 words means you can give in about 100 words. So like that you can give the input prompt. Let us see how ChatGPT will generate that paragraph content from this text. So here you can see the text describes the graph that displays the power output of photovoltaic system generation over time. The graph also vertical axis labeled power and a horizontal axis labeled time. There are five different curves on the graph, each labeled acronym represented with different control strategy. The curve shows how the output power varies over time for each strategy. So like that it will generate a content. So before that I have done the same. 
So here you can see uh, that uh, it is a detailed explanation. Here I have given about only for 100 words. Here you can see the detailed explanation. So here you can see the graph has five curves, each labeled with different acronym HOA, DFO, PSO, ACS, and PO. So here you can see that one. That is that image. So you, just a minute. So this is the HOA, DFO, PSO, ACS, and PO. These are the different MPPT algorithms where it is described in this particular content. So and also it is uh, high power output obtained on the graph is 1500 watts which is represented by a horizontal line. So like that it will generate a paragraph content related with that particular image. So if uh, after generating this paragraph from that text what you have to do is you have to copy and paste in your word file and you have to customize it accordingly for your output if you don't need a, uh, some lines you may not need so you can delete some lines so it will give you a uh, that is what i what i am going to say is that is it will give you a outline of the thing what you have going to write so if you are struggling to write uh, the paragraph a long paragraph content from an image that is the result you have taken from simulations you can use this kind of method to generate a paragraphic text using this chat gpt and ocr text so this is an important option available uh, to convert your uh, image that is result image into paragraph text and you can customize accordingly for your uh, requirement of the paper. So this is the first option. So next one is I am going to copy and paste the table. So here I am going to copy and paste the table. Here I am going to give you a prompt that explain in detail detail the above table in favor of so any method you can give for example I am going to propose the DO method so DO method so like that I am going to give so let us see how it will generate the content. So here you can see our content is generated, our table provides information on different control strategies for optimizing power output in a photovoltaic generation system. So the DO method is designed having shortest convergence time and shortest GM settle time and compared to the other methods registered table. So like that it will generate the content related with that particular table. For example, I am going to copy and paste the table just giving explain the about table like that I am going to give means about table like that I am going to give means let us see how chat GPT will generate the content so this is the normal gen uh, content generated by chat GPT not in favor of a particular method so you can uh, make sure that can you can use this content for your requirement accordingly so hope this video will be very helpful for you. Those who are struggling in writing the result and discussions part of your research paper, this will be a helpful, uh, helpful idea for you. So thank you for watching our videos. Have a nice day. Thank you.